All right, I think we're live. Oh, camera's over here. Oh yeah, camera's over there. Well, hey everybody, Drop we are, well, no, we're in the middle of a class, so. <laughs> we're, we're at Cal Ranch. Yeah, we're at, uh, well, it's like tractor supply. Yeah, you can't even see it. Yeah, anyway, we're doing this here tonight. Um, we're, we're at a class. A couple of months ago, we had uh, Caitlin from Kate's Meets and Meals on our Facebook Live, and she was talking about the, the class that she was gonna be doing. It just happens to be right now. So they're talking about... Um, hey, Heather. Hi, Heather. Um, they're talking about doing um, ribs right now. And we're like, oh, we are so supposed we to be doing a Facebook Live. So, yeah, we just ditched out really fast. Um, this is going to be kind of short. Sorry. Um, but, yeah, so we just got some really cool tips. Um, I recorded a video of we'll to how to... Oh, here. I'm totally going to post yeah. it. Hi, hi from Idaho, Idaho, Idaho. indeed. Teresa. In Orange County, cool. Nice. Um, yeah, so this is going to be kind of quick, but I am like I, I was just saying, we they just showed us how to pull the membrane off was of it, pork is it ribs. Is it called the silver skin? Uh, they usually just call it the membrane, but it yeah. is the silver skin. It was so cool. Yeah, he like got. He, he, he just he, took some seasoning and put it on his hand. Yeah, and he he cut a little bit. I couldn't see it very well, but my yeah. camera saw it. So he just Maybe. he used the salt to uh, get some get some uh, grip and grabbed onto it and just, just thump, yanked it yanked it right off. It was, it was so like, cool. Just had this big old thing of ribs. It was awesome. Yeah, Deb, don't worry. We'll ditch the live in just a little bit. Mm. Um, short and sweep is good because three kids. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. We we only good. have six kids. Yeah, so. and one of them keeps calling me. Yeah, I should probably just call him back while we're on our live so that everybody can see I love my child. <laughs> should I really? Okay, go ahead. Um, let's see. What do we got going on this week? So first off, we got um, make some stickers. We have stickers. Um, yeah, we have stickers. Yeah. I'm really gonna call my son. You can all see. <laughs> Just so you know, we have stickers available on our store. If you order over $100, you can throw one in for free. Hi, if Melody. You, if That's you ask us, one. we'll probably just throw some into your order for free anyway. Put an order comment and say, Hi, hey. Emily. Hi, Emily. Just Hi, say, Sonny. throw in some stickers. Hey, we're still um, at the store. Anyway, so while okay? Miriam's talking to Sam. <laughs> um, okay, do you need anything? Let's see, this week we have Root Beer Float is on sale. Um, it's the 10% off... Uh, flavor of the week um oh, let's what? see what else do we have got going basement. on we'll um, actually be home in like a the half face hour. the, the ad that we, we got going on home. on facebook is still going oh um, okay do you let's want to see play a game on your tablet emily hi there you guys hi back <laughs> um oh okay. i'm trying i usually okay, i have like a thing. list of all the stuff that uh, we're going to talk about and today's been so crazy we're getting ready to go on a trip okay. Um, well, and so we'll it's be been a little like bit nuts. Minutes. So, but have some food. Yes, have some food. We have leftovers He's from just yesterday. He's all alone. Okay, I love you. Root beer float is the best flavor. Okay, <laughs> Anyone who disagrees is obviously incorrect. I personally love root beer float. There are some people who don't. And one of the funniest thing is uh, everybody has okay. such different tastes yeah some people they'll absolutely love flavors other people will hate them hate them hate them some people don't like banana anything they try the keto chow banana and they're like that's amazing so uh cookies and cream job, is sir. back in stock we only got 300 of them um really briefly um but yeah we we should have more coming um, by the way, we did add a get notified by email when stuff comes back in stock feature. Oh, yeah, um, so that'll be nice. So, for instance... So you can go ahead and put your email in there, and then it'll yep. email you when it gets there. Um, so, like, last week, we got in the, hey, the spicy taco soup, and uh, all of the people who had signed up to get notified of that... Got and we got email. We actually got the, uh, the cookies and cream at the same time. So everybody who signed up to get notified of both of those got an email right away. Nice. Um, we should be getting the tomato probably... Maybe this week? Maybe next maybe week? Maybe this week or next week. We'll see. Um, and so we'll have to have Holly and them test it out, see if it, if, if it passes quality. 
Um, and if so, they'll put it in stock and it'll just magically, everybody will uh, get notified that we've got the, the tomato. Yeah, so be Creamy good. tomato basil. Um, but yeah, yeah we which do have... we are going to serve at Keto Fest, by the way, if you guys yes. are going to go. That's the idea. So it's um, going to be good. With, Carl um, tried it and he said it doesn't taste tomato y enough for him. I, well, that's because the tomatoes have carbs in them. So yeah. Here, I'm going to go like this. So okay. Because I'm falling off the shoe bench that <laughs> oh, I'm sitting sorry. on. Sorry. Let me that's scoot okay. over a bit more. Thanks. I keep trying to remember to look at the camera. The camera's right here. Yeah. Oh, speaking of right here, look how cute. I got my cute oh, nails. Oh, new nails, today. huh? Yeah. It's for the cruise. We're going what on the What is it? It's like a seashell? Yeah, it's a little, it's still a little starfish with a little bit of sand. And Anyway, right. just, the picture doesn't look very cute. There's my nails. <laughs> Um, speaking of the witch, people keep on talking about... Speaking um, of the witch? Yeah. Oh. We, today, we, we did a cutout of the witch. Oh my gosh, we can't even show anybody I know. today. Dang it. Um, we, we had it done. It, it actually has her face cut out, and she's life-size, which means that the which witch is a little like short. Which means she's like this yeah, she, In real life, the actress... So I could put my, my chin on her hat. Yeah. <laughs> Melanie, the lady who plays the witch, she's about five feet tall. And hey, Amanda. So, um... She's so cute. So the, we made it life size, yeah. and so Miriam's like, "Hello!" Ducking in there, putting my face in her little face. But uh, oh, uh, Emily wants to see the nails. Oh, so, I just put it up already. Yeah, but she didn't see them. Oh my gosh, there they are. All right, uh, what else do we have going on? Um, there's a lot of uh, questions that are, keep popping up on the Keto Chow Facebook support group, so be sure to check that out. Um, yeah, I'll try to answer them. Yeah. If it sounds uh, girly, it's me. If it sounds smart, it's Chris. So you can just yep. guess who's talking. And uh, my access to internet over the next like week and a half also is going to be limited. Too. Yeah, Miriam's too. Because we're going on our cruise Yep. on a boat. It will be interesting. So next week, oh, I guess we should have planned for this. There won't be a Facebook Live next week. Yeah, we, well, could, there we could do a Facebook might Live be. on the ship. We did one last time. Yeah. I did one. Okay. We'll do one. We'll just see if the it works. The Facebook Live next week is going to be we'll show you the spotty ocean. at best. Um, it'll probably be really low bandwidth and very laggy. Yeah. So don't be surprised if it lighting, kind of like sucks. This one. Yeah. yeah, this very this lighting light. is super your awesome too. Your forehead's like totally shiny. What are you talking about? My forehead's awesome. Oh, and show everybody your cute haircut. Look. Oh, what a nice wife. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> really pretty. Yeah. Let's see. Um, we're going on the low carb cruise. With Jimmy Moore. Yep, and in case you didn't know there was a low-carb cruise. There's, there's there is. a low-carb cruise. Um, if you go to lowcarbevents.com, uh, there's a big, giant listing of all the different uh, low-carb events. Low-carb cruise is, is one of them. Yeah, you so should we're gonna change be going all your plans there. and come with us. I think it might be a little late to go on the low-carb cruise. I there, think you can do it. There is going to be another one in September. Um, but Oh, Robert, you should get some keto chips. Yeah, we got the sample packs. They're uh, mm -hmm. super easy to get into. Hi, Jason. Uh, he's actually gone already. Oh. He came on and he he's gone. took off. I know. Hi, Mel. Yep. So let's see. Um, keto Cruise. Yep. Yep. What else do we have going on? Uh, we're going to go to New York. Yeah, we are going to stop in New oh, York. You mean like keto chow wise? Yeah. Let's see. Um, <sighs> you mix it with heavy cream, butter, <laughs> last six days in the fridge. Yeah. Yeah, the typical questions that we always get is uh, about uh, what do you mix it with? Um, I prefer to use butter. Uh, melted butter. You melt melted it. butter. And use warm water. And warm water. Because if you use cold water and melted butter, it it's work. not going to work. Yeah. Um, it does so. last up to six days once it's mixed up in the fridge. Um, we've got 18 flavors. If you're having problems mixing, try doing it with butter. Mm -hmm. uh, that's one of the uh, big things that we posted about this week is there were some people because of a change in the formulation a while ago um, that s under certain circumstances doesn't mix quite as well uh, if you do mix it up warm with warm water and with butter it works out super well um, oh it was Memorial Day yesterday oh yeah <laughs> so we had um, a day off yeah we, we did have a day off fun little barbecue and we almost got all the orders shipped out today we yeah. came really really close um mondays we are always 1070 did we really 1077 oh, wow. um so that that's was a good. lot yeah um but after a three-day weekend it's always really nuts um yeah. we did so yesterday was memorial day and is butter with heavy whipping cream possible sure thing yeah, absolutely yeah um no reason you couldn't do it um oh 
it, when you freeze keto chow for ice cream, I just saw Heather's comment. Yeah. We just just put it in an ice cream churner and then eat it right then because it kind of goes hard. Yeah. So if you but yeah. you could just let it melt and stir it up and then it'll be okay. And the reason why it's just it, not like regular ice cream. It's got a lot of water in it. Yeah. So it forms a lot of ice crystals. Um. So yeah, doing it again is more as a, of a soft serve works really well. Or you can put it in popsicle molds. Um, Heather wants to know about salted or unsalted butter. Whatever you prefer. Yeah. I like salted because I like everything more salty than it it's should true. be. Because <laughs> salt is so good. And we have a lot of salted butter. I think we have probably about, oh, we have about 16 pounds of butter in the freezer right now. Yeah. So. We have a, a bacon freezer and a ground beef freezer and a butter freezer. Pretty no, much. No. <laughs> <laughs> there is 15 pounds of bacon in the fridge that we need to uh, put in the oh. Oh, yeah, freezer I bags. Sorry. Um, Packing. Yesterday, uh, yes. Memorial Day. Yes. I did remember finally that I, uh, we hadn't ever posted publicly that we do have a military and first responders oh, yes. discount. Yes. Um, it's, and we appreciate your service. Yeah. If you go in the shop keto chow drop down menu, um, there's a link to it right there. Uh, it's a service that we're using that authenticates that you are actually that, and then it kicks out a discount code. Um, and yeah, so what else we got going on? We we should probably get back to the giveaways. class. We uh, they're they're sm in our lives, they're smoke, and we don't have any giveaways going on. Yeah, they're doing a uh, tri tip and sh um, chicken. What's a, what was it called? Spatchcock. Spatchcock. You, they the took chicken. scissors and they cut, and they cut out the, the backbone. backbone out of the whole chicken and then went like this with it. And uh, are, are smoking it that way. Yeah. I'm sure a lot of you already know that, but yep. I don't. Hi, Debbie. Um, Nancy said uh, for business owners, a day off is, it's seriously, it's not a day off. It, it's just a delay. <laughs> it's just a delay. It means twice as much work the next day. Do your kids eat keto as well? They do <laughs> Some for the of most them do. part. So two we have of two them daughters. are super on board, and they would get really angry if I yeah. even think about other food. But, um, yeah, the kids will eat what's in our house, and we don't mm -hmm. have non-keto foods. The only non-keto food we have is uh, low-carb tortillas, which is our bread version. Yeah. And we pretty much have it for them. Yep. Um, we did have, we had a customer come in today with his, like, four kids uh -huh. who were all keto, oh, very nice. strict keto. And he was, he said he was looking for something that they could eat at grandma's house. Oh, okay. And so they were trying keto chow. They were sampling all the different flavors. Um. Well, and they were nice. super excited about it. Nice. And I was like, do you know about Rebel Ice Cream? He's like, yes, I do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. so our kids do eat keto pretty much. They go to school and eat some school lunch. Yeah, some of our kids. Our two daughters who are strict keto, they don't. We they, decided they just we wanted to let them yeah. learn. Well, and it's we're the teaching them to teach them the things and then they'll hopefully yeah. choose the right things. Well, right? you can't force people to make a dietary decision like that. That would just be stupid. Um, if they're if they want to if they're ready, then they can. One of our sons yeah. used to do keto, and yep. he decided he wanted to eat school lunch with his friends. So, but he's like our kids are super low carb anyway. So yeah. whether they're in ketosis or not, they're still probably less than a hundred carbs a day. Hey, Rhonda just placed her first order today. Rhonda, yay! Welcome nice. aboard. <laughs> Welcome to the keto chow family. Yeah. Anyway, we better get back to the class. This is super short. Sorry. Sorry. And it's late. But, but we'll post that video of the guy pulling the, oh, the, the, the membrane. membrane off the ribs. That was awesome. It was so cool. Um, but thanks, everybody, for joining us. Like like we said, next week on Tuesday yeah, we'll be it's sure. probably going to be even worse than this. It'll probably be longer, but it'll be probably using... Probably in and out. Yeah, it'll be like... Uh, yeah. Go back and watch the archives. We've got uh, archives of all the Facebook Lives we've done. And usually they're much higher production quality than this. Um, so, thanks everybody yeah, for joining not us. Crooked shoes. I yeah, mean, shoes I wish in the I background. Picked a not crooked shoes. Oh, I was gonna show him. There's just over there. There's like hats. Oh yeah, let's walk over there real quick. Oh, you want? Because it's cute over there. Here we go. It's gonna be like super pixelated when I go over there. We got hats far as the eye can see, and, there's and a, a poor guy who didn't know he was gonna be on the internet. All right, Here, where are you at? Where are you at? <laughs> You're running away. <laughs> All right. So long, everybody, and we'll catch you next week.